Hi, I'm Andrea, and I am the founder of Project Lamb. Project Lamb is a blessing and storytelling ministry, and I started it along with my dad and sisters in memory of my mom, Mary Beckwith. And in June of 2011, she was diagnosed with stage four lung cancer. Uh, my mom was always extremely vibrant and full of life. She loved Jesus and she loved sharing her faith with people. It kind of shook my family when she was diagnosed because it was such a quick and rapid disease that was just taking over everything. And um, it kind of came without warning and without reason. Her best friend came to visit her in the hospital and she didn't know what to buy her. She walked into the gift shop and just sat down and she was super mad and she cried out to God and was like, what do I get my friend, Lord? How can this be happening? And so she looked around, she looked up and she saw this little tiny stuffed lamb. It was just a stuffed animal. She grabbed it and she took it up to my mom and she was like, okay, Mary, this is your Jesus lamb. And so I want you to call him Jesus, even though we know he's a stuffed animal and he's not the real Jesus. I want you to know that you can cling to him and remember that the real Jesus is near you when the nights are long and the pain is too much, that you know you're not alone. And so my mom, being who she was, took that little lamb with her everywhere she went for the whole six months. Uh, but she actually used it as a tool to share her love of God and for people. It really helped her open up doors and talk to nurses and other people in the hospital room. And then the last day in November 2011, my mom went up and met Jesus herself in heaven. And right after she passed away, it had been stirring in my heart that this little lamb was such an easy way to share love, to share faith, to meet people right where they're at. It's gentle, it's simple. <laughs> and so later that spring, we were able to form a 501c3 nonprofit, and that was in 2012. We're able to find people in need. We've been able to speak at different churches, share my mom's stories, and then find new ways to help. In the past 10 years, over 2,000 lambs have gone out. We really wanted to try to just make sharing the gospel easy. And we think the best way to share the gospel is to love people. 